The story of our business is quite an eventful one. It all started way back in 1988, with me sewing covers at the ripe old age of 21 in a tiny wooden shed beside the beach in Breen in Somerset. Then early one morning in 1990, a huge wave washed the shed off its foundations. Hence I transferred my little business to Bristol, well away from the sea. I moved into an old garage which seemed huge at 2,000 square feet. The business continued to grow over the next few years and by then we had a total staff of seven. Then, in 1998, three days after returning from my honeymoon, disaster struck. I got a late night phone call to say my workshop was on fire. But with fantastic support from family, staff, suppliers, customers and friends, we got back into production from temporary premises in only 13 days. Rather than return to the old garage, I managed to buy some premises in Cater Road, Bishopsworth, which were huge at 10,000 square feet. The only problem was the building needed major refurbishment, but again, we all mucked in and got the place ready in just three weeks. With all this space, we really wondered how we'd ever fill it. But over the next 14 years, as we added additional specialist divisions to our business, it continued to grow. So we had to install a full mezzanine floor as we were fast running out of space again. In 2012, we got the unexpected chance to buy the premises next door. And so we grabbed it with both hands. Having used 720 litres of emulsion to repaint the place, we were finally ready to knock through into next door. A year later, we were then able to create our lovely new showroom and further expand the range of services we offered. We're so pleased that our customers have warmed to our transparent way of working. I think the fact that we actually still make things here in Bristol and don't ship them in from China is one of the reasons that our business is still thriving. I'm so proud of the whole team. Many of them have been with me right from the very early days. It's been a fantastic journey and it's their hard work that's enabled the business to grow into what it is today.